men lost their lives while attempting a wingsuit flight at Yosemite National Park. One of the men, Dean Potter, was a well-known extreme athlete, famous for his daring climbs and base jumps. In 2011, National Geographic aired a piece in which Potter walked a high line over Yosemite Falls and spoke of his great love for Yosemite, the place of his eventual death. Yosemite, it really brings out my creativity. It's such a powerful place. There's some sort of amazing energy going on that fuels me. 43-year-old Potter even made his home near the park for about two decades. His climbing partner, 29-year-old Graham Hunt, also lived near Yosemite. Both were prominent figures in the park's climbing community. The two men were scheduled to make a 7,500-foot jump Saturday. Someone called for help after they didn't return. A park ranger said a search and rescue team looked for the men overnight but couldn't find them. On Sunday morning, a helicopter crew spotted their bodies in the Yosemite Valley. No parachutes had been deployed. Base jumping is illegal in Yosemite. Ready? Three, two, one, see ya. Potter made headlines last year for this video of him base jumping with his dog Whisper along for the ride. The Guardian reports while the dog did sometimes accompany him, she was not in his backpack on Saturday.